and people are making preparations for the winter weather. That's on the way, but not as many as you might expect. News 8's Josh Scheinblum explains. We're here in North Haven where we've already seen this evening some signs of precipitation. Nothing that's really going to make a mess out there on the roads just yet, but there are people across our state who are getting ready. This was stocked. We have plenty of bread in the house and plenty of leftover food. The shelves at the Big Y supermarket in North Haven are filled with milk and bread. It's what most people would expect when they go shopping. That is, unless there's winter weather in the forecast. Those items are typically among the first to be taken by people preparing for whatever Mother Nature might have in store. And Tuesday, it looks like winter is expected to make its official debut. Brother, just stay home if it's going to get icy. The chance of wintry weather is what brought some in Guilford out to page hardware. However, some like Jim Romanski believe it's rain that will be the biggest problem. I'm still concerned about the rain, so I came here to get a uh, ground fault circuit protector for my Christmas lights because they're out there in the rain all the time and I'm worried about people and electricity, you know. It's easy to understand why many New Englanders don't have snow on their minds. The fall and winter seasons this year have been unusually warm and dry. I haven't put my shorts away yet, so that's how it's been. I think the weather's been so warm, I think everybody's like, no, it's not going to happen. You know, it's 60 degrees. Here at Page Hardware, you'll even find snow blowers and shovels being sold outside next to grills. Sue Wall is the manager of this establishment and says traditionally popular December items like ice melt and sand are selling slowly. I think they're waiting to see what the weather's going to be. Um, no one's really come in. A couple bags, I think, of ice melt went out today, but nothing, nothing crazy. Sue adds whenever Jack Frost does come to Connecticut, they'll be ready. Their shelves are full of winter supplies. In fact, Sue says she's looking forward to the day winter forces them to be busy again. It would, after all, be good for business. I am looking forward to it, <laughs> definitely. Municipalities are also getting ready for winter weather. Here's a statement that we got from the city of New Haven. It reads, quote, city officials continue to carefully monitor weather predictions and computer-aided forecasts to ensure preparedness and the most appropriate response to challengeable conditions this week, including whether or not to pre-treat city streets ahead of any frozen precipitation there might be, end quote. For now, we're in North Haven, Josh Sheinblum, News 8.